If it moves the needle, if it gets people talking, it's on the top five at five. Today, we got the top five Bill Murray movies. Since today is Groundhog Day. Uh, number five, and it was a close one. I got Kingpin. Bill Murray as Big Earn, great comic heel. And the scene at the potato bar was almost 100% ad-libbed by Murray. I just said, twisting your arm to Munson. Uh, Kingpin beat out Stripes. Uh, Stripes is a bit overrated. It's Murray 101. It's very basic. An ensemble cast, but hilarious. Number four is Wild Things. Uh, semi-straight, semi-comic, and right in the middle of a dark crime drama. Great work by Murray. And when it turned out at the end he was in on it all along, that got a big pop from me. Number three, what about Bob? Murray assumes the character. He's lovably deranged. It's a unique buddy comedy with him and Richard Dreyfuss. It's my understanding they did not get along on set either. What was the doctor's name, Richard Dreyfuss' name? Dr. Blah, blah, blah is a genius. Your death therapy cured me. You genius. Uh, number two. Caddyshack. Murray's barely in it, but he steals the show. And it's barely a movie. It's a collection of skits, a collection of vignettes, but it just works. That's why they put the gopher in. To have a constant that made it more of a story. And number one, of course, Groundhog Day. It's Murray's best performance and his best movie. Funny, dark, and sweet, which is a very rare combination.